sure. Yeah, I thought it was a um, hard-fought match, and I'm glad we were able to grind it out in the end and uh, you know, move on with a, get over another hump with our program and into a national championship match for Saturday. Questions for the student-athletes. Nick, uh, fifth set, you had those three points in a row there where that was that had to be the highlight of your volleyball career, I assume, at this point, right? You had a little kill out of the middle and then back to back block, right? Yep. Yeah, just take me through what was happening there. And, and um, I just remember going in and I just, I, I knew we had turned some points on defense, so I just, I made sure that I was going to be up big as much as, I, as much as I could, and I just did what I, what I normally do every day in practice. And, Basically. Tom, what does it mean to you to get this far and make this, you know, get this next step? Uh, it means a ton to me, but um, I just think it's so great for this team because uh, I've never been a part of something like this where like each guy, I mean, number one to number 27 works just as hard as the next, knows their role. I mean, it's just, it's, like, it's so cool to be a part of and uh, we're definitely not happy though. We have, we have work to do, we got practice tomorrow. Yeah, it means a ton just to everyone. It's great for the program, um, especially that we're hosting. It's just, um, I mean, we're really happy tonight, but tomorrow we have practice. We have more work to do. I mean, it had to be, it had to be a very emotional roller coaster type of match to play in, right? I mean, yeah. it, and then it, at the last set, it didn't look like either of you wanted to win. <coughs> yeah. Shane, yeah. um, that was brutal. It was up and down for a long time. They, I, you got to give them time credit. Right? They're, I thought their serving was incredible. Our video didn't do it justice. I mean, even their float servers were giving us out of system. And Aaron Russell and uh, Goodell were just pounding the ball from the service line. So uh, you got to give a ton of credit to them and what they did from the service line in their first contact. And we have to clean up our first contact. Um, Thomas, can you talk a little bit, or and Nick as well, can you talk a little bit about the crowd tonight and how you know 4,000 screaming Loyola fans at 11 o'clock at night helped you? <laughs> it was amazing. The greatest feeling I've ever had in my life. I remember coming out of the fifth set out of one of the timeouts and just like looking up into the like the stands and just feeling everyone yelling and it was just absolutely incredible. Yeah, it was definitely overwhelming. I remember the same moment uh, I know Jack was talking about. Everyone went nuts and um, it's just like it's just so great to be able to play here, to be able to do this for our fans and uh, that was that was awesome. Yeah. And Thomas, jumping out to talking about the first game, you know, you guys seem to be clicking on offense. How important was that? Not only for the team to be good on offense, but for you to be putting away, you know, five, six kills in a match just to get your offensive rhythm going. Um, it was nice. You got to give a ton of credit to Hutz, though. I mean, I just, I just jump. That's all I do. He, he has to put the ball in the right spot. And we run a pretty fast offense comparatively to everyone else, and uh, so I mean, that's all Hutz. He does a great job, and uh, he knows where to put the ball and when to put it there. And uh, I mean, what I do is the easy part. He just Hutz has the hard job. So it's all people. How do you guys feel that being in this being in a similar situation last year, making it to the quarterfinals, how do you think that's prepared you guys to kind of grind out this win this year? Um, I felt like we're mentally we're in a, a much better spot than last year, you know, coming in with uh, with a uh, with a bye and then being in being in this moment at the same time, but I felt like our play didn't necessarily demonstrate that. Um, I felt like we were a little Passive in a lot of our areas, uh, especially our serving, uh, serve receive was a little uh, shaky at a lot of the times, and those are two things that we take a lot of pride in that we've done really, really well all year. So, you know, I think mentally we weren't as great as maybe I thought we were going to be, and I think it just shows, you know, one set hitting 400, the next set hitting 100, then 21 service errors for tonight. So, um, and a lot of those in the net or just easy rollers out of bounds. So. It's definitely uh, on Saturday. We definitely need to work on our serving and stay aggressive uh, against Stanford, or we're going to be in a lot of trouble. Questions for the student athletes? Uh, Nick, like uh, Tom has mentioned, just how big is this win as you get to the next point? It's huge, especially for the program. I mean, we work day one. We set out this goal, and you know we're just one step closer now. We got you know, a good Stanford team on Saturday. We're really going to have to you know pull our stuff together and play well. Anything else for the student athletes? Yeah, Tom, uh, I think the 24 kills was your career high. What other than the team out the crowd, you know, you didn't win just those two Um, It was just, um, I, I connect really well with us. Uh, we're super good friends off the court, and um, I just I just know when he's going to set me. Um, I, I 
I just know where he's going to put it. And I just think that was it. Um, we haven't really gone five in a long time, so I think that was the biggest part. Um, he just he distributes the ball well. I mean, yeah, I got some kills, but he, he puts the ball in the right spot. I think that's the biggest thing for me. I don't really do a lot. It's all it's all. Kind of off that. This is only. last thing we do, game five. So we were, we, we were fine. We were good. Yeah, exactly what he said. We do that every day in practice. And you know, there's no doubt in our mind that we're winning every set. If, we, if somehow we lose, we're winning the next one.